There are two types of news you can make in Schoolbox. There is global news and homepage news. Homepage news is news that is added to a homepage. This is done by adding the news component to a homepage. Global news appears in the news tab. In the news tab, you will find all news relevant to you. You will find there are different topics that your school has set up to categorise news. You can click on any one of these tabs to view news specific to that area. In the top right corner, you will see the Archive News button. Clicking on this will show you all news that has expired. This can be filtered by date, and by topic. By clicking on the news item, you can read the full article. If you have permissions and want to add global news, click on Add News. Give the news a title. Write your article in the field that says Article. You can insert media into your article using the embed tools. You will learn more about these tools in future units. You can also add a blurb to your news article. This is a brief summary of what your article is about and will appear with the headline. This is an optional feature. If you do not add a blurb to your news article, the summary will be comprised of the first 300 characters of your news article without any extras like videos or images. Your blurb can contain basic text but cannot include more advanced functionality like videos and images. These things you should put in the body of your article. To add a feature image to your news article, drag and drop an image onto the paperclip icon. The feature image will be displayed next to your article. Choose the topic that your article is relevant to. If you can't find a topic that is relevant for you, you can talk to your super users and ask them to add more. Choose the role that you think the news is relevant to. Remembering you can select more than one. Then choose the campus. To add specific users, type their name into the search users area, wait until they appear and then click their name. They will then be added to the audience of the news. This might be helpful if the news item you are creating is relevant to one role and one specific user. For example, you might want to send out a news item to all junior students but add a few specific teachers that need to know about the news as well. The other option that you have is the ability to set a publish date and time. For example, I might need to send a news item next week. I can write that article today and set it to go out next week. To set the expiry date, select a date and a time. Once you're happy with your news item, click Add News. The news will then appear in the relevant topic for the relevant users. It's important to note here that if your school is using the Email Digest, you will not receive any news items that you create in your Email Digest. This is because you already know about these items as you created them, so you don't need to be notified about them in your email digest. All other users that you have set the news to be sent out to will receive it in their email digest.